Welcome, I'm from is a Samsung Galaxy Note 20 and today I'll show you how to capture a screenshot on this device. So there's a couple ways we can do it, but we're gonna begin with the first one. Uh, now to start, let's open up the content that we wish to capture and have it visible on the screen. And from there, the first way would be to just simply press power key and volume down. Like so, you'll get the animation and there we go, there is the screenshot. Now you can also capture a scrollable one by tapping right here. As you can see, it will keep extending it until you reach well, the bottom of the page or you simply stop. And from there, as you can see, there it is. So let's leave. And the second way is through the side panel right here. So number one, we would have to add the uh, page right here. So let's go into the settings. And from here, go to the smart select and simply leave. Go back to the side panel. And there we go. So we have a couple different ways of ways of selecting it. So we have the rectangle, which will select just an area and you can resize it, move it around to where you want it. For instance, let's just select something like this, tap on done, and there we go, there's the image captured. Then there is also a novel, which is just a circle. Again, same premise, I'm not gonna save it now. And we have animation and pin to screen. Now pin to screen, I believe if you select something, it will keep that area pinned and there we go so you can see that it's gonna be visible um, now let's actually get rid of this there we go and the last option was animation now I guess you can record a screen never actually use this one so let's actually see how it works so It doesn't look like I can do anything apart from this, so let's leave and see if this will do anything. So apparently I cannot really interact with the screen while it's recording, so I expect you have to have it open before you actually start recording, otherwise it won't really work. So. And anyway, those are the different ways you can record. Now all the things that we have recorded or all captured can be found in the photo gallery. So let's open up the gallery and go back. There we go. So we have today, we have the part of the screen that I have captured with the crop. Then we have the scrollable screenshot from the settings and simple settings right here. So that is different ways you can capture screenshots and if you found the video helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching